a day-to-day detailed schedule not only helps us to keep on track but also helps us with proper time distribution and higher work efficiency. Students, businessmen, doctors, managers or individuals from any background use a daily schedule for personal or public use. Let's discuss some examples for daily schedules in Excel. Hello there, this is Fariha Dulmim from Excel Demi, your one-stop for Excel blog posts, discussion forums, templates and VBA-related answers. Our problem today is to make a daily schedule in Excel. We will discuss six worksheets containing daily schedules using Excel 365. You can use any available Excel version as well. In our first example, we will discuss a basic daily schedule. In the merged cell of cell B2 to E2, we have added a title for our table which is creation of basic daily schedule for the worksheet. In column B, we will add starting time of our schedule. So in B4, let's type starting time. In column C, ending time. So let's type ending time. In column D, we will count the total duration between starting time and ending time. So let's type duration in column D4. And finally, in E4, type task where we will add the tasks for specific time slots. We have prepared a schedule along with starting time and ending time. We have copied the data and we'll paste it here. For calculating the duration in cell D5, let's try a formula. Our function tab C5 minus B5, closing parenthesis. It will bring the hour value from the difference. Ampersand, double inverted comma, space, hour, space double inverted comma this part will add the word hour beside the hour value ampersand now minute function again c5 minus b5 closing parenthesis this part will get the minute value of the difference of ending time and starting time ampersand double inverted comma space minute this part will show the minute word beside the minute value Enter. Now let's drag it using fill handle till D14. See, we have already got the duration values. You can see that there is an error for the last row. It is due to the ending time is prior to the starting time. Actually, the ending time belongs to the next day. So we can just manually type the value here. That will be 6 hours and 15 minutes. Easy, right? We have a task list from a draft schedule. We have copied it and we will paste it in E5, Control V. For better visual, let's select all of it and go with all borders. And for the headers, let's go with center and middle aligned, a larger font, bold, and a fill color. And we can see that there are different tasks. Let's add different colors for the same type of tasks. So getting up and go to bed. Let's use fill color, performing household and reading stories, performing household and reading newspapers. Let's go with this color. Having breakfast, taking dinner, watching television. For that, let's use this color. And the time outside home, let's use this color for that and for evening prayer this color using the same structure you can set your tasks and be more productive here we will create a daily schedule for a school which runs through an entire week since schools have different schedules for different classes of different sessions there are separate sections to add that information merged cell from b2 to h2 has been used for title as development of daily schedule of XYZ school. Class ID 9B and session is 2022-23. So in B4, type class and section. And in F4, let's type session. Merge B4 and C4 and F4 and G4. 
in cell C6, let's type 8 to 855 AM. In D6, type 9 to 955 AM. In the same way, let's continue. In 86, let's type 2 to 4.30 p.m. In 87, type practical classes. Merge C7 to F7 to write theoretical classes. Let's add our class section, which is 9B, and our session 2022-23. Now, merge B6 to P7 to write time days. Here we will write the weekdays Monday, Tuesday. Since Sunday and Saturday are our weekend, we can add them and write their weekly holidays and we can avoid adding them as well. Let's drag till Sunday. Let's select C13 to H14. Merge them to write weekly holiday since it's an off day for school. Among the five weekdays, Monday to Friday, XYZ school has theoretical classes from 8 a.m. to 11.55 a.m. and 2 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. is for practical classes. Here, in between 11.55 and 2, we will have the lunch break. So let's just select G6 to G12. Merge them to write lunch and prayer break. Since it is not visible, we can change its orientation and choose rotate text up. Now we can see it. We have a draft schedule copied. Let's paste it here. We can format it as we wish. Let's select and go with all borders and for colors. Let's use for the titles this fill color and for the time slots let's use this color and for the week names let's use this color break and holidays can be used as this color we can also bold all of this and select center and middle alignment for this from this structure we can change the course names or time slots as per our requirements for a daily schedule for abc university let's add a heading first we have selected b2 to h2 to add a title creation of daily schedule of abc university for template let's copy the template we prepared for school select it Control c on B4, Control v University daily schedules are based on weekdays and schedule repeats every week. Since it varies from session to session and credit hours, level terms are different for students as well. Let's insert another row in row 5. Insert. Here, let's merge them. Here, let's type department and on F5, let's type credit hours. Let's choose PQR as department name and let's go with 20 as credit hours. Let's change class section to level term slash semester. Let's choose fifth as semester. You can change the routine, session, department, credit hours or even modify the time slots according to your university daily schedule. For any hotel, every customer is tracked based on their check-in and check-out information. Here is a daily schedule of XYZ Hotel for a customer named Anthony Hopper. Using room number 523. We can change this data set for every room and every customer. Service type is added here for hotel information which is 24 7 as your demand let's add 1 p.m as check-in time in 18 may 2023 
and checkout time will be 11 a.m. and date is 19 May 2023. Here is a daily schedule for a student that includes every small and big work with allotted time slots with their starting and ending time and duration as well. First, let's add a heading from B2 to E2, typing creation of daily schedule of a student. Now, from the basic schedule template, let's copy it and paste it on B4. Let's change office to school and office time to school time. You can change this structure according to your requirement. Now we will create an example of a daily schedule for a businessman. For that, we have added a heading in B2 to E2, typing creation of daily schedule of businessman. We will follow the structure of the basic daily structure. Select it, control C, paste it here using control V. Here, we can type the entire time, 6 p.m. Let's delete these rows. And here, type stay at grocery shop. From the schedule here, we can see that this businessman spends most of the time staying in the grocery shop, which is his business. Let's change reading stories to checking inventories. So we can see that he spends the rest of the days with household work, checking inventory and other regular works. As a businessman, you can make it a more detailed schedule where you can add meeting times, topics, whom to meet with or where, etc. You can also keep tabs on which works are done, which aren't. From these six examples, you can understand how versatile a daily schedule can be. You can practice this problem with the help of the Excel file in the description box below. Let us know if you were able to solve the problem in the comment section with suggestions and feedback. Stay tuned by subscribing to the channel and clicking on the bell icon. Like and share the video if it helps you. Thanks for watching.